I'm Nomad. Could you please come to the principal office? You have some explaining to do. Damn. What are I done doing now? Yo, what up, YouTube? It's your boy. I'm Nomad, and I'm back up inside this piece. You know what I'm saying? So what's good? What's happening with y'all? Please make sure to check out my last video, Ghost Recon First Impressions. It'll be down in the description below. Now, I have a little topic on hand today. I'm pretty sure it's probably been covered, but uh, I want to talk about it again anyway. Uh, it's kind of like pretty much about Twitter and YouTube. And uh, it kind of seems like it's the real world college and high school thing all over again, man. I mean, you got your, you know, your squads, you got your rich boys, girls, you got your middle class. You know, you got people, you just got groups, man, You're just sitting there, you know, they all help each other out, and they don't help nobody else, you know? And that's like the rich class, man, they only up for themselves, man, kind of like the big YouTubers, they only associate with other big YouTubers, you know, they don't even try to go down below with the real people, with the real talent that, that's the underground, you know what I'm saying? And boys, everybody that's under there, know who they are, and they definitely need that shine, but it'll never happen as long as you got the big YouTubers being dickwads and stuff man and pretty much cop blocking you know people from moving on up so it's crazy so it's just kind of like high school man you know you got your rich you got your rich crowd you got your middle crowd and then you got the people that sit and come to school just to see what happens sideliners you know so yeah i just want to address this topic a little bit i mean it ain't gonna be a whole lot a little small thing you know because it's kind of irritating man uh you know people think that yo I tweet this guy right here, the big YouTube guy, man, but they never hit back, man. Oh, they're not going to hit you back, man. They're not. You can just hang it up, man. I mean, only way they're going to hit you back, man, if you come up with a video and I think it's like instant success, man, then they'll jump on your dick. Then they want to be your friend because they think you, you know, you're the next big thing or whatever, man. But hey, man, they're probably just using you. So, I mean, you got to keep that same intensity and heat up, man. You know, it's crazy, man. I'm probably like, Ramming all over the place, but that's just how I work. So you either listen or you don't. I don't care. So yeah, pretty much, man. If you think you follow, tweet, and comment a big YouTuber every day, think they're gonna actually hit you back, even though they say, "Hey, we read your comments, we read your, you know, your thought, your feedback, and you know, we, you know, we try to respond back." But man, if you go through half of the list of big YouTubers and you look at the comment section, man, or you check their Twitter. Man, they ain't responding back. Matter of fact, check how many people they follow to people that follow them. They follow only their selves, man. It's crazy, man. They don't even try to reach out. You know, try to bring new talent in the fold. Because, you know, hey, they, well, I guess they're greedy. Want to keep all the money to themselves, man. So it's kind of like, you know, once again, high school, college, man. You got the rich kids, man. It's, they're always on the team, man. Always on the team. They don't even have to try out. They just get on the team because parents got money. Something like that, but the people in the middle class, they got to work hard, they got to prove, they got to show themselves, man. It's crazy, man. And I'm pretty sure some of those people came from middle underground too. They had to start somewhere also, but they act like they forgot where they came from. I mean, you ain't just become an overnight sensation at all, you know? You just don't come overnight sensation. Some people do, but still, they had to start. And I'm pretty sure that even on YouTube, it's just not like, hey, you instant star because there's a lot of people on YouTube so getting noticed is kind of a hard thing to do unless you got something that just unique that nobody else has in this world and uh that's pretty rare yeah man so I'll tell you like this uh I do follow a couple of other you big youtubers not a whole lot of them I left comments before and of course they don't respond or whatever but it's cool though I was just giving a comment it don't matter I wasn't really looking for anything in the first place man now you gotta I gotta mind y'all now I've been a viewer for a while uh, I've been watching video videos a lot so actually my original username on YouTube was blood film and uh, some guy some of the people remember me by that name but uh I was trying to get everything synced up with my YouTube, Twitter, and my Xbox Live account, but my Xbox Live account, uh, Microsoft flagged my name for some reason. I guess you can't have the word pimp in your user tag anymore, so I had to change it. So I went to what I had used to draw one of my characters. I named him uh, Nomad with the K. Always been with the K, not the M. Not the N, I'm sorry. And uh, Nomad was taken already, so I just put the I'm Nomad because I am Nomad. Nobody else there better than me, you know? So. I've been watching for a while and uh, when I finally got a hold of, you know, finally found the right group to be with and 
really started checking their videos and stuff, I always would respond and talk to them and stuff like that. And uh, they would talk back, and I'm like, one day when I get my job, man, you know, I'm going to, you know, do the same thing. I want to give back and everything and stuff like that. And that's what I've been doing. So, yeah, you'll never get that kind of response from somebody big in YouTube and stuff like that. And uh, a lot of them, if you start, you know, talking trash about them and they see it or one of their fanboys start letting them know that somebody's talking trash about you. I don't think they should be talking trash about you. You're my idol. I worship you. You know, then they might pay attention. They're not going to respond back. Only thing you're going to do is get that block button. That's about it. Fucking bitches. It'll be all up in, you know, panties up in a bunch and shit, man. Pull up this skirt, man. Call the car. They ain't got that blood, man. They ain't got that blood. They got that thin ass skin. Gotta be built tough for YouTube, man, because uh, having thin skin on YouTube, that shit ain't gonna work, man. People in the world are fucking mean, man. They mean. And if you can't take that shit, man, you need to ride out, homie. I mean, for real. That go for women, too, man. If you can't take that, uh, that kind of abuse on YouTube or cyber bullying, if you want to call it, then you don't need to be here, man. Because, uh, trust me, if you was a fucking movie star, it'd be the same thing. They're going to jump on you, too. I mean, sure, you got fans and stuff. Uh, you, you sign autographs and stuff like that. And then somebody start talking or telling the truth and you're hurt. Oh, no, I want security to get him because he said I, I wasn't a good actor. <laughs> Please help me. And then, yeah, you do all that stupid sh- I don't care about all that, man. Shoot, fuck it. So, I just want to, you know, touch that little bit basis, you know, letting, letting some of these people out here know, you know, if you're looking for one of those big guys to reach out and help you out, don't. And I'm not saying come to the underground thing is going to be instant. Also, I mean, they'll help if they see you not just trying to troll or just trying to use people, man. But you got to put in that work or uh, give nice, constructive, you know, feedback criticism because you know people don't like to be used man and uh trust me i wouldn't want to be used because it would be stupid man i mean using people well it's the way the world works i guess huh you use me to get ahead and then you leave me behind if you get ahead you don't forget where you come from oh man that's all i had to say about that man pretty much it's been bothering me i say you know so if they say they're ever gonna respond to you lies i say lies i'm telling you so you know, this your boy, I'm Nomad, and uh, make sure y'all check my last video out. Like, subscribe, and comment, and I'm out, this bitch. Peace.